what's going on? It's been a while since I've uh, made a video here. I've been just busy with life, but today I've got a couple of unboxings for you. I figured you might as well share. One of them is for a buck knife here that I bought it and I, I was looking for reviews online. I couldn't find anybody. So while this isn't a review of it yet, this is a, an unboxing. So this is for buck knife. Uh, this is a fixed blade. This is the Sulkirk 853 um, knife. It is made out of 420 uh, high carbon steel, which mm, it's okay. But it uh, the complaints are that I've seen that people had is because it, it's made in China. So let's see, we've got a little warranty card here. And here we've got the knife box. All right, put this over here. So this is what you get. This is what comes in the box. Let's see. Sorry, the lighting's not the best here. I need to. I didn't have time to set up my other camera to do this, so we'll just go with what we got. But uh, it has got a plastic sheath, a uh, little belt clip holder on here, which feels pretty sturdy. So we'll see how that goes. Um, my car to handles. There we go. And you can't really see. I'm sorry about this coloring. I might have to do another one of these. Let's see. We're going to hold it with the lights hitting it. There's the buck knife. And then I noticed right away, even though there's a buck knife, let's see if we can see it on there. Right up here. Over here. China. But it's a... Uh, I mean, it's a nice little knife. Fits pretty good. It's got some jimping right here on the top. It's pretty sturdy. Uh, this little notch here is not for your finger because you will slice yourself right there. It's all the way to the edge sharp. But you can use this for a fire starter, fire, fire stick, ferro rod. Uh, but Buck 853, this is right there on the... This just won't focus because this is my computer's camera, but... 853 buck knife but it's nice feeling little knife and the uh, this little sheath I mean it's a little it's not coming out you can hear it clicking but it's not coming out so for what it is for camping backpacking hiking you got self nice nice little knife I believe this is a uh, eight and one fourth inches uh, from tip to, to butt here. And uh, I know the full size one, you can use this as a hammer. I don't know on this one, I'll have to, to look it up. I don't know if on this one you can actually use this to hit stuff with it or that'll break it, but we'll, I'll look it up and I'll add that to the, to the comments underneath, or not the comments, the uh, information underneath. And I'll also put a link to the to Buck's website for that. The other thing I've got is I've been carrying around this Leatherman uh, Surge for two years in my pocket. I love this thing. I use it all the time. I use it for work, for camping, hiking, fishing. This is awesome. But I've just been carrying it in my pocket because it didn't come with a sheath. So I finally got a sheath. So I got the Leatherman sheath. This was like, I think it was like nine bucks. From, believe so we've got this card on here it's got a bunch of different leatherman pouches tools in the back not tools but pouches for different tools it's kind of cool so depending on what you got um, you can find the case that fits you this is a nylon case it feels it's pretty thick uh, button front snap button here Kind of looks like a back of a shotgun shell. Uh, inside of it is, it's got a little bit of uh, stretch, some elastic on the side, so, but it's a little strip, so hopefully it, it holds up. There you go. So, I'll do a, uh, a review on the knife. I'll do some video with better video of it 
chopping and see, splitting some wood and feathering. We'll see how that holds up. Let's see how sharp this is. This isn't probably going to show up on here. Let me see. There's some hand hair. Let's see if it. Yeah, that's pretty daggone sharp. That's a sharp little knife. See the hairs on there? So right out of the box, it's a sharp knife. Uh, high carbon steel is easy to sharpen. Um, and it's stainless, so. My, my, the next knife I want to get is the, uh, I'd like to get like a Rat 5 Ontario Knife Company, um, which is, you know, bigger blade, a little bit of bigger handle, and it would be better for, for camping, for splitting wood, chopping, stuff like that. But this is a nice little everyday carry knife, fixed blade, full tang all the way through. You can see that jumping right there. So... Uh, I'll do a review on it, but I wanted to do an unboxing because the only knife videos I saw or videos I saw on this knife uh, on YouTube were of, I, I don't even know, I think they were Russian. <laughs> I, they were in, not in English and while the videos looked nice, I didn't understand what they were saying. So let me know what you think and that's the knives. Y'all have a good day. I'll be back on whenever I get something else done box. Bye.